Peggy 12. Driver, the first game ever to feature open city driving, is well and truly back. And what we've done actually is very much go back to the roots with the game and what made that such a unique experience. So we've brought back Tanner, the undercover cop who we met in Driver 1. He's a little older, a little more hard-bitten, and also his arch enemy Jericho. And this sets us up for a relentless manhunt between these two historic, iconic characters. John Tanner is a character we created over 10 years ago, but uh, what makes him uh, sort of iconic is uh, a coolness about him and detachedness about him. But, uh, you know, he's pretty much prepared to do what it takes to uh, take down his enemy. He's got no way out. Call it in, I'm gonna take him down. When he was much, much younger, uh, as a kid, he was a, a, a racing driver on the stock car racing circuit. And he gets into a bit of trouble and eventually finds his way and he becomes a cop. And because he's such a great driver and such a great personality, he finds his way through to being an undercover cop. Tanner is a bit gung-ho. He's ready to go over the top to get the job done. Quite often uh, he'll find himself skirting very close to the edge of the law, if not actually on the other side of it. And that's when uh, his partner Jones comes into it. He's the calm one, he follows the rules. And he really cares about uh, Tanner. They've been, uh, they've been partners for years. And he's the one that tries to keep Tanner back from the brink. <laughs> hey, Tanner, talk to me. Next up, it's a big day for justice. Convicted cop killer and international smuggling kingpin, Charles Jericho faces sentencing later today. It's principally a story about revenge. Tanner is absolutely driven by his desire to bring down Jericho. And you always knew this guy was super dangerous. You, you always knew that this guy was gonna be more than just a hitman. He's got a lot of influence and he's got a lot of, uh, he's got a lot of people that he, uh, that he has under his control in the prison service and then uh, throughout the city. He's a scary guy that can manipulate things and uh, make life a real problem for Tanner.